Hi everybody, welcome to an episode on power cuts and survival options. As the title suggests, I imagine most people in the UK have experienced sometime in their life a power cut or outage. My aim isn't to go in depth. A review as such, a must have, how to, or even lightweight ideas for backpackers, hikers, or campers, etc. There's plenty of reviews on the net. Let's get you started out of the starting blocks as quickly as I can. I hope keeping the content simple, not complicated, and as you can imagine, you can make a decision. If you come to this video, the item or items should help you, I hope. As always, Brian, stop faffing on and let's get into it. Hi lads and lasses, welcome to a quick unboxing and have a look at the Cru Crusader cooking system. As you can see this is the cooking system packed away for storage. I've also bought the lid for the cooking pot. That will be later. So what I'll do now is take it apart, place them out and try and explain as best I can each part. Right, starting at the top is the, the plastic mug and the water bottle says keep away keep away from heat or flames and it's there you go normal army mug more later water bottle we'll find out how much they hold because I can't remember Somebody they put the cooking pot itself or a mug. I don't know if you can see the markings on the side. BCB limited and it's got a marking 0.25 litres 0.5 litres yeah. moving on to the actual stove itself as you can probably see inside they has as you can see inside it's got a a bowl yeah now I'm thinking one hexi box also it a push in the bowl methylated spirits and also if you've got a 
Trangia burner. So there is a few options there on the fuel that that you can do. Let's have a look at actually set, starting up or getting ready for cooking or boiling. Fuel goes into the bowl and the mug stand comes down. At the same time, using your, your bo uh, water bottle, fill it up to the appropriate level, and then, then light the fuel, and then place the mug in there. And what I've got now. I bought my own BCB lid. Catch you in a minute. Put the lid on top and we'll wait for a boil. Get in there, really. Have a look. Oh yeah. There you go. There you go. Have a look how much fuel is left. Oh my god, plenty I reckon. All I need to do now is try the brew. So hopefully this 
video makes help or hopefully this video helps you and we'll, we can look forward to the next episodes of looking at other fuels and also timings catch you later